Alfred. I'm Sarah. We're... This dude's hat with his, like, gut really work well. Like, the, 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 the stock of this fellow, the... the it's a really good design. I like his ring too. Check I, that out. Oh shit, you're right. That's Ooh. dope. Look, it's got a gemstone in it even. What is that? Like black onyx? Obsidian? Fuck yeah, dude. That's a cool guy right here. And then, um, so the whalers have um, gutting swords, which are made for opening up whales. Mm -hmm. These dudes all have these like uh, chunky ass machetes almost. They're like, I honestly love the Bottle Street Gang. So do you think this is what you would be with? Like, I, I think so. If you, I can't you would pick. Have a, you would have a bottle and a... Uh, uh, a bottle of flame shit and yoink and a uh, machete <laughs> I think so that's fair cause like they kinda got a dope setup. I would want to be with the whalers just cause like anything that gets me magic and sword play is what I want especially considering how like active and ready the magic is. I'm very okay with just, like, using my fist to get around. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel about the color palette of this game? Um... I like it. I think it's, you know... Some people think it's too washed out. Um... If anything, I don't mind how washed out it is. I just wish there were some things that were a little more striking. And you could argue that, like, the red banners and whatnot are very striking in contrast to the washed outness of everything else. But, uh, I hear you, bastard. So, no, yeah, I would, I would like to see things that were a little more striking. Because even, you know, your runes are a, a brown, you know, color, which just kind of... Very neutral with the wash. Look at how many fucking cards there are. Ah, right. So that's the wall of light. What do you think about it, my love? Um, I think that it works. The the magenta, not magenta. The navy and like all the dark colors really help make the game atmospheric. And I, I think. I think the fact that this game wanted to be like all navy and tan and stuff, as opposed to it really wanted to look realistic, so it had to make everything like brown, tan, gray, green. I, I think that that makes it a lot better, you know? Yeah, that's, I mean, I, I that's a great line, by the way. The boldest measures are the safest. I've been saying that all through quarantine, by the way, as a reference to this and why that's maybe a bad idea. My fat feet. Rat time. So the walls of light are meant to burn out um, rats. Where are you? Uh. And they're literally just like these big, like fucking walls of electricity. You can see it arcing there a little bit. Uh, powered by whale oil, at least. I'm really afraid that you're gonna de rat. In yeah. I think I'm good. How does it work? Good job. What? The wall of light. Oh, yeah, Isn't check it out. Wonder? It's one of Sokolov's latest inventions. I'm out of fucking sleep. Uh oh. Yes. Oh no. Oh, Alfred, no. But all the hair Ooh, you're doing it. So yeah, they're talking about it now. Um, the implication that the Wall of Light was came to Sokolov in a vision is very interesting. Oh, because it might mean that some... Uh, what's the guy's name? The Outsider. The Outsider may have... May have actually influenced his invention. Which is really interesting. So, uh, it, it kind of seems like you might all just be being, you know, fucked with, with a, uh, deal. That wasn't... Highly lethal vector. Like, like, great ones as in... It's not clear. What, dude? You just killed your own guy. 
Can you see that? Look at this carnage. Oh, oh. I'm getting a little better at the sword combat. Yeah, you're doing well. You know what? My bother. Yeah, did you see that fucking guy? This dude ran up to, to fucking sword me. Yeah. This guy shot him in the spine. Let's get rid of these bodies, shall we? Nom, 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 nom. Come with me, my guy. There you go. Um, yeah, that really didn't go well. I mean, your friends are fed. Yeah. The, the fact that I threw the whale oil into more whale oil, that was that was really a real this, fucking this, shitty domino effect. This is a pro rat playthrough. Yeah, that that's what I that's what I said. It, it's not that I'm going for the high chaos or low chaos ending. What I really want is just to create the rat utopia, and that means I've got to take the cat down. <laughs> the, the true bisexual picking the third option. Yeah, golden cat, finest ladies in the aisles, skilled in the sensual art. But we're not going to go in through that way, because that way is actually kind of difficult. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to take Slackjaw's way. Attention. Go go I'm ready to it. see some this ladies. So yeah, going through this way gives us a few more options into getting... Oh, fuck. I forgot about that bone charm. Shit. I'll go back. Yeah, give me that. Whale oil. Whale oil as a concept is still so cool. Like, it's not, it's not, like, straight phlebotnium, it's not, like, it has some rules and limits and logic, but, like, I really like how it works. It's very, very smart. Maybe I go through here. i just give this one to me. Robust one. Potions give you more health. That's all right. Pistol. A lot of bullets. See, the thing about, um, sorry friends, the thing about bullets is that they kill pretty much anything you shoot them at, but they're pretty poisonous. Just barring a little bit of your, ooh. Sorry, bullets aren't fucking poisonous. Um, they're noisy. All right. Upcoming areas riddled with, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Poisonous bullets, just in case the bullet didn't take care of you. <sighs> Sir, you've got lead poisoning. Ah, from the bullet. No, you were shot, you idiot. <laughs> so, so normally we would come in through there uh -huh. and just look at how unprotected that is. Whereas this way, we can go across the rooftops. So make a little save. I actually, um, now that I've seen this garden, I'm actually going to take back what I said about wanting, like, more striking colors. Like, this is very striking, and I, I'm i really digging it right now. That, yeah. That's why I was so silent for a hot second, because it was like, oh. It's pretty. Bones, 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 Okay. Yep. Ooh. Ooh, hello. Yeah, very, very Morgan's red. I'm gonna go into Madam's office. Ooh. 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 So, upcoming, I'm gonna have the ability to kill a guy. And it's kind of a gruesome death. But the dude's a weirdo. It's okay, I'll cover your eyes. No, no, do you want me to kill a man? In an, in an excruciatingly gruesome way. Um, is he a bad guy, or...? Uh, kinda. Uh... I don't know the context, so I will leave that decision up to you. Well, you'll see in a bit. They ship them in from farming villages. Bastard daughters. And extra mouths that can be fed. So, in case you wanted to know... Yeah, some of the women here are kind of just kind of forced into work. Here's the first part. Sounds like a brothel. Here's the next part. Oh, yeah, 
got a room now. So, should I save it? Should I get something? Um, how many runes do you have? I have two now. Yeah, I would save it. Okay. What? Uh. No, don't kill the ladies. They're so pretty. <laughs> well, that makes you feel weird. Look, this is a normal Tuesday for her, right? And then just right on the mattress. Let's let her sleep. Oh my I god, I found her! <laughs> wow. I didn't even mean to find her. She's just here. I imagine she's the one doing the choking. <laughs> so. You're wearing a mask to sneak around, aren't you? Let's be clear here. Emily is definitely Corvo's daughter. And, and, the person dead, like, like mother. and this is even confirmed in the sequel. That seems like a long time ago. But I much dead. rather prefer no, her you. not being I mean, I Corvo's daughter, at least publicly, for the first There's game. A special door to come and go for special people. Yeah, I and agree. Because it's and if you know tries to stop us, you can fight them. It lets you like put yourself in Corvo's shoes a little easier as well. Yeah. This way. I like the I really like the idea of Corvo just being I really wanted to explore the brothel more. Oh don't worry, we're we're gonna go back. Right. They thought they would be working in a factory. I've always like really liked that um you know early nineteenth century lingerie look. Yeah. Did you know that little girl back? No. She's cute. Amy or Emily or something. She tried to escape. I came for the butts, but I stayed for the conversation. Really? Yes. This sir makes me feel like not a pedophile or a pervert or a weird creeper. Anyway. Anyway. Crowbar I wanted to come and see like pretty ladies and like know about their sensual arts, but now I just feel bad. Yeah. Emily. Come here, girl. Come on. Oh, I need the key. Put the plague swept through here. Uh, it's locked. There are rooms they have yet to clean. Prudent, the old hag. She caught me trying to get away. Now she keeps the key with her. She I have never met a person named Prudence where they weren't. A terrible person. Until you get the key. Yeah. Like, what if you named your daughter Chastity or Sobriety or something? You're you're gonna... You, you've cursed this child, you know? Don't do it. Don't name your kid shit like that. So I could just go get it right now. You know you should name your kid? Hmm. Hope. Hey, if you've named your kid <laughs> Hope, I'm gonna axe kick you. And if your name is Hope, it's okay. Your parents were idiots, though. <laughs> Your parents? I'm, I'm sure there are plenty of fine people named Hope out there. Yeah, never met one. Is that just... It's just cute. This also, um, this is very Bioshock right now. I'm just, I'm loving the, these reds. And then out there, I love the, the sharp green. Yeah. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna, um, sneak around here. Do some more sneaking. Uh, fuck. So Emily is now safe, but she can't get to Sammy. Uh, dude. Well, that is not a sound you want to hear during a play. You're definitely infected, bro. Ah, oh, fuck, I'm out of sleep darts. Damn it. Can you make those? Uh, yeah, I can buy them. Mm. Why haven't you? <sighs> Forgot. Uh-huh. What the? Oh, fuck. oh, I'm sorry. I'm out of sleep dart. Sorry. Yeah. I mean, you guys attacked me, so this is basically your fault. <laughs> Welcome to victim blaming the Let's Play. Look, you know what these guys are really doing? Standing in the way of hungry rats. What is this? It's a woman? It's like a woman with a, a it's like half of a woman. Uh. There's one huge leg. This is kind of a buttock. There's half of a torso. There's one huge boob. There's this one the, arm. you know how this makes me feel? Hmm. This makes me feel how the Silent Hill nurses make me feel. Yeah. Told you about. 
You realize you're at Where it's like, I look, head. you know, at yeah, first, and I'm like, different. ooh, and then a little you know, closer, like, and I'm like, ah. And then I look even more closer, and I'm like, ah. Let's see if I can't. All right. Ooh, maybe I can wrap my way past them. Actually, let me save. Hold on, did I save? Better save. Better save. Better save. Oh. Huh? I'm a statue. Dude, not cool. I'm behind the statue. I'm on base. Uh, sorry, everyone. Oh, I could have just got through here. Carmen A. Horse fucking thing. Wait, take a look at that, that pretty lady. Helena Bonham Carter? <laughs> Is that you? Daughter of Tivia. Oh. Okay. I'll be the Duchess. No, wait, you be the Duchess. Young Lady Amelia in the back garden. Duchess, I do not know the world beyond these garden walls, but do not mistake my lack of experience for fear or an absence of desire. If I've avoided you, it's because of the warning your name carries. And what warning is that, my dear Amelia? I believe you know the meaning. Your father's tales are still the subject of a parlor gossip. And do these stories excite you? Tell me, girl. I am a friend. Duchess Kali, I... Yes, I confess they do. In my youth, I hid a copy of the tales of Prince Kalisar. <gasps> I read them late into the night. As did I. But he was your father? They're just stories, Amelia. Fire for the imagination. Duchess, will you teach me to kiss? I will. But have you never kissed another? Iberia Rose Gardener, emerging from the hedges, stammering. My ladies, I swear to you, I did not intend to spy. Forgive me, but I was pruning the hedge. That's a weird way to say you're masturbating, man. <laughs> I could not find a way to interrupt. We forgive you, but as punishment... I command you to stay, and to come closer. But he is a servant, Duchess. And serve us he will, young Amelia. Dude, I didn't think that we would actually get a sequel of that, but whoa, I'm so whoa. pleased we did. We're getting some fucking F. <laughs> we FFM. hope you liked that. <laughs> oh, that's that's dominant. That's good. That voice. All right, I've got three now. I never really liked Wind Blast, but it's pretty useful. You can like blow back grenades. I would have much rather like uh, uh, a Bioshock Kinesis. <laughs> These guys had a good night. <laughs> Yoink. Just sit on them. Why don't we have a third friend join the party? Are they dead? Nope, it says unconscious, see? Oh, okay. Though I wanted to, I could kill them. Oh, no. Oh, that's cute. Now I am Santa. Just jump off. Let's go. It's really hard to get back on. Ah. Uh. I've done it before, actually. Nom, 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 nom. All right, let's see how I'm getting through here. Hmm. I imagine that there is a quick save and quick load, but I'm using a controller and I don't want to fuck around I hope, with it. I hope some of these ladies are having a good time. Like, I hope this is a good job for them. Yeah. You're supposed to be on guard. You'll get dismissed for sure. I can't believe this. You said you weren't even drunk. Wake up. Ooh, we're getting gossip. Okay. Yeah, I'm curious. Check like, it out. Eh? All right. Oh god, this am is I about of, to see it? This is one of the best in the game. Okay. Finally, I've been like this for 20 minutes. Oh god. Your footsteps sound a little loud. Have you gained a little weight, honey? <gasps> now, just like last time. Hold on, but I want to hear him talk. Slowly, and only trigger the shock at my command. Get it? And the safe word tonight How could you be in such a submissive position and still be like, have eh, you gained weight? Yeah, right. Out of line, and you are out of a job. 
He's getting excited. Look at his legs. Yeah, he is. He's very excited. Stay focused, please. Oh, oh, oh that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? So this is also his confessions. I cheated them. Robbed them of thousands. Self-flagellating? Yeah. Oh, you're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you You're still fat, though. Don't forget it. I'm still the man here. Very dominant. Junk. So, what do you think happens if we keep pulling this lever? Retribution! Retribution! Oh, just keep going. That was perfect, but it's all I can take. Oh, okay, hold on. Call my servants. We're done. Ooh, one more. One more. I said retribution. Now let me out. Oh, is retribution the safe word? Yeah. That's a good safe word. I'll have you whipped, you bitch. Oh, Karen. What the? Who is this? What do you want? The safe. Yes, of course. The combination is one, three, eight. Imagine how Take fucking scary it must be. I, think I felt my heart skip. To be like, oh, I'm gonna have a sexy time, and then you get tortured and then you hear a man's voice say tell me the fucking combination of your safe so what do you think a few more we can kill him right now if you want it would look like an accident is he a bad person uh, yeah he was literally telling us about how he's a dickhead oh let's go let's go let's go i don't like how he still kind of likes it won't take this ask me anything I screwed the Pendletons, yes, and, and I've been to the Brimsleys. They worship the Outsider. I've seen it. I did it, too. Fucking coward. Is he dead? No, but he's unconscious. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. Oh, no. Oh, you, you can't do Oh, it. I broke the machine. Well, guess that's the end of that chapter. Oh, okay, so no death? I'm not sure. Anyway, yeah. Isn't They're going to go in there and be like, he had a good night. <laughs> isn't that fucking great? You get to be the fucking Dom and torture some guy. And then, and then you're like, Yo, give me the fucking combination of your fucking safe, bunting. Please don't ask for credit. <laughs> what? Who? Oh, they heard my footsteps. Like a shadow. Fat shadow. <laughs> Corvo goes home feeling a little self-conscious. Uh, I'm no one. So in Archer, right, uh, Pam, one of the characters, has a driving ring where she, like, races the Yakuza. Uh-huh. And, and she, uh, she has a nickname that she assumes means white shadow. Oh, no. But it's actually Japanese for white pumpkin because... <laughs> <laughs> Please, don't make me destroy you. Oh. I got the rats ready for nothing. Sorry. I'll take a chance. Look, this is, this is insurance, you know? This, this is how is I make so sure. so nice. Like, I would just like to go here and hang out, you know? Um... It's the nicest place in the city. I can't remember if there's if it's in Baldur's Gate or Planescape. Oh boy. So if I wanted to, I could just go kill Morgan right now. Uh huh. But I'm gonna do the non lethal. Okay. Uh, that's actually what I just did. Ladies, excuse me. I don't like that one. That looked like she was wiping her butt. Fine, more rats. Hello, oh. Jay on the job. I've got to get back right now. Um, fuck, I was going to say something. So I can't remember if it's in Planescape or Baldur's Gate. I remembered it. Um, I can't remember which one it is, but there is a platonic brothel. Oh. 
It's run by a succubus, and it's run by people Ow. who. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, ladies. Are there boobies in this game? Uh, not really. As far okay. as I know, at least. As far as I remember. Be a pain in the butt to try and blur it out. Yeah, I can do it. It'll be annoying though. Ladies. Um. Yeah, there's a platonic brothel. It's uh run by a bunch of dudes who... It, it's run by a succubus, and all the brothel does is it has very smart women talk about mathematics and philosophy and shit to men who want to feel like they're smart. What do you think? Should I kill Prudence? Is she... She's bad, isn't she? She's the one who runs the brothel. Is she a... She's not a nice woman. She's got eyeshadow up to her eyebrows. Go ahead. There we go. And you know what? I know it's a little gamey, boys, but have at it. Wow! They got her in a second! She had no meat on her bones. Lord Morgan Pindle Pin Pindlin Pindle Pendleton. With Lily in the steam room downstairs. Bunting with Betty in the silver room, second floor. Custis Pendleton with Violet in the gold room, third floor. So the steam room, you can actually smoke Pendleton out and just, like, asphyxiate him with steam. I, uh, chose to... And Jeff, in the study with a crowbar. <laughs> we already have it, Jeff. Ah. I cannot get rid of all these fucking mixers. Shaboom! Tibian ore and some crust pearls. So yeah, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna double back and go talk to Slackjaw. Which is this way? Yes, yes. Here, hike. I'm excited to see my favorite character so far. Heard some. What the book says it helps. That was it. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh. You're doing it! Oh, you're doing it. Bye, everyone. They saw nothing. And not a speck of evidence left behind. Someone's supposed to be on duty over here, they say. Yeah, I think that's a, there's a little problem. Huh? Damn! Oh, come on. My followers, <laughs> help me, aid me. Uh, Weeper's down here. We'll probably lose him in there. So they're now rationing whale oil. Mm. Oh. So, game of the year, you think? Uh, it's good. I enjoy it. Well, this was the game of the year of 2012. Oh, really? I, well, for a lot of people. Go ahead and pause it. I think that's everything. That's what uh, these are. I hope we get a... Uh, Notice third... that these two are smaller. Oh, no. What were you saying? I hope we get a third entry on the... Uh, the uh, oh, series. Awesome. Yeah. A lot, of, a lot of queerness I didn't expect from this game. Yeah, and like, it is it is still hidden, but like, I like that I can find and seek my gay fan fiction here and there. A Wipe, wiping my hand, like rubbing my hands together like a little fly. A princess, a duchess, and a servant boy? Hell yeah. Two rich men fucking the brains out of each other? God yes. Hell yeah. Hell fucking yeah! <laughs> So if you want, you can actually take the combination of the safe, tell Slackjaw the combo, and then go find the safe yourself and open it up and steal everything out before he gets oh. to it, because you can warp there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be a nice guy, and I'm going to just be honest with him. Well, you gotta. Here you go. You brought me the numbers. I've been after this combination for months. If you ever need steady work, you come see me. I like this Slackjaw man. Slackjaw knows a good man when he sees one. I do it's like only natural that you'd be curious about what I intend right, to, to listen do up. Pendleton's. 
See the Pendleton. Oh fuck. Oh no. Sorry, I'm gonna turn that off on the recording. Got these rock mines. Have hundreds of souls working down there half a mile deep below ground. So I'm gonna shave their heads and cut out their tongues and put them in one of their own stinking mines. Then they're gonna see life from a different angle. Ooh, Targets my. neutralized. Oh my. Just know nothing about it. Just straight up, they've been neutralized. Oh my. So yeah, they're now slaves in their own mine. You know what? I respect this man. Yeah. Not only is it a, uh, not only is it non-lethal, they, they are not dead, you know, but it's also ironic. And isn't that the best? Isn't that ironic? I mean, you know, it is literally ironic. Yes. I'm sorry. I am robbing him as well. But I figure... Oh, uh, you know. The, the money that he'll he get, get... He gets it. The money that he'll get from the safe is actually, I think, more than what I can get out of here. I mean, what happens if he catches you robbing him? I don't know. Oh, he's humming that song. Mmm, yummy coins. Now, how do I get out of here? You have to be a rat. Mmm. Oh, here we go. I was feeling a little uh, suspicious about summoning rats in here. Considering that the rats are not very well trained. I love them, but. You know. Sometimes you just have to let your kids have their own freedom. God bless them, but they really do not know how to distinguish friend from foe. <laughs> I've been chewed on more times by my own rats than fucking piranhas. Back to Bottle Street. So yeah, and I'm gonna head back to the captain, um, the hotel the captain. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I'm gonna go take Emily her key. Oh, hey, Graf. Want to look at some of the things I've found? Good prices, I swear. Let me take a look. So yeah, I can buy sleep darts from him. Yeah, I get some of those darts. Oh, shit. I'll get two. Um, hey, you have quite a bit of money. So. I've basically, yeah, I want to spend it on upgrades though. Mm. I always, always prefer buying permanent character upgrades than temporary power ups or uh, ammunition. Especially I'm when you're just gonna do the kill playthrough. Yeah. Oh Jesus! How did I get this fucking bone charm? It's been bugging me. Distraction. I know you're somewhere around. I can't remember what battle it was, but there was a battle where people used corpses uh, as biological warfare. It was actually fairly common. People would you uh people like would a, throw cows. It's a it's a famous battle and it starts with an F, I believe. Yeah, people would throw cows, they would throw plague ridden dead. A tramp like you get Alexa. Oh. You've been on half rations for a week. I ain't catching the plague. Hand it over. No, please, it's for my baby. He needs it. No, I need it for my little one so he won't get sick. Now, I hope your baby's a rat, otherwise you're dead too. You saved me. How can I thank you? I have nothing. Oh. Wait. Take this. It's the backdoor service key to Bunting's house. So we if I take this key street. and I go to his house, I, I can actually crack open the know, safe before, before the uh, Slackjaw gets there. He's let all his servants go, but he's still I like there. Slackjaw. I do I too, so I'm not going to do it in this run, although I have done it in the past. His. I don't know what he has left, but it's all I have to offer you. Please take it. Again. Long live the Empress. She was a bitch. I mean, it says wench, but... Excuse me, madam. <coughs> Hello, boys. Oh, I think I'm getting boys, closer to it. Boys, 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 boys. Making little cute rat noise. Weepers. <gasps> oh, fuck it. Hello, weepers. Meet your reaper. <laughs> It's Granny Rags. Oh, hey, Granny. Allison's letter. 
Uh, I've been given a geologist position with a Horizon Trading Company in Sirkanos. Oh, I think Sirkanos is where Corvo's from. We'll be taking our first survey south of Karnaka. Don't wait for me too long to leave. There are rumors of people being denied passage. Wait for me there. Hey, assholes. Handsome one with a beautiful dark eyes. Hey, will you throw from my mouth, baby bird style? Yes, Granny Rags is There's so many of you! Won't you? If you see him. Hey, Granny. Grandma! My gentlemen callers don't come around like they used to. You took care of it for me, didn't you? That's nice. I don't understand if these are hooligan or gentleman callers or if they're two separate enti entities. They're the same. The Outsider. Diary of a known heretic sees before execution. Most outsiders a child's tale meant to instill fear beyond the family, the community. When I was young, mother and I were on the run. We moved from one village or sea town to the next. Camping in the woods. Always with the cursed overseers at her back. One night she told me in her dreams of the empty place with the outsider whispered to. With each visit, her craft grew until she could see through the eyes of moths and unlock a door or window latch from outside of a house. I will find this empty place. Somehow the key will open the void. The key to open the void will fall into my hands. In time, I will learn the secret and he will call to me as he called to her. Call me a heretic for the studies. Drag me to your uh, cones, uh, cold stone cell, whip my flesh and put me on trial as an apostate, burn my body to ash. But I will continue to seek the realm of which my mother spoke. It is my life's meaning. Neat, neat, neat. I do like the outsider. Let's take a look at this. Blood Ox. Your max mana has been increased. Oh, nice. It's not bad. Hey, that's a safe place. You know, in a lot of video games, a safe place is actually just a dumpster. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to double check and see. We have been recording for 36 minutes. We can go a little longer. Yeah. This place is on the river, so you must have come by boat. I'll wait for you near the Oh, boat. I just found it. <laughs> I am in the Don't worry about me. Rescued Emily. Nice. Uh, let's see if I can't find the last few goodies here. Oh, I've got the... Excuse me, ladies. Butts. I promise I'm not trying to upskirt you. But. I'm just trying to loot all the goodies. It's really nice of these women to not hear you whatsoever. Well, I'm a master of stealth. This is their toilet? Jesus! It's like a gas station. Gosh. Do they even get dental? That's honestly like the funniest scene in Shrek 2. <laughs> that scene makes Shrek 2, I think. You don't need to get done. You don't need to get done. Like. <laughs> Did you know that um, uh, in France they would actually have bidets uh, in the early 1900s? And um, the, a lot of the reasons why bidets didn't come to America was because, you know, they were seen as just kind of like filthy because they were in brothels and stuff but you know they used them to clean themselves up and all the men who came back from war didn't want their wives to know that they knew what a bidet was morgan and custis pendleton checked out at seven setting an appointment with the lord regent Ew. Oh, oh man that's so good the girls do not like this new adam She's, She's not, not kind. Not at all like the old one. Good thing we took, I, yeah. took care of her. Good thing I killed her. I feel, you know, I feel better and better about my decision to murder that woman. Oh my god, I was in this fucking room. I missed this? Vengeance. Getting damaged gives you adrenaline. Somewhere in the household, our cat's ears perk. Yeah. Our cat's name are Vash and Vengeance, because Masi Menos was taken. how we feel about them. Eh, so-so. <laughs> uh, We're I, kidding. I'm kidding. I believe, we love our boys. I believe Masi Menos is a uh, Teen Titans character. I know them from the Teen Titans semi-anime. Oh, do you know what it means? Uh, yes. Yeah. My dad explains it to me because my dad knows Spanish. Oh. 
Every time I learn something about your dad, I'm just... Room! You got four now? Yeah, I've got four. What'd you think? I could upgrade rats. Ooh, I really want, um... Better position? Yeah. It's just one more rune, so I can wait. Um, that's everything. Send us food, not run. bullets. Apparently I'm still missing a rune, but whatever. I really like that one more than Make Love, Not War. Yeah, I'll get you in the ricker. Can I just... Yep. I can. Would you ever get a tattoo like this on the back of your hand? Uh, no. That's fair. So I feel like my wanton slaughtering probably uh, degraded my score, but the fact that I did most of it a lot less lethally than before was pretty good of me, I think. <laughs> I should be given a commission for this. Good job. Beep. So, we're done with the mission. Yay, we did it! And Emily's back. We did it! We did it, I yeah. mean, you did it, but... I was here too. You were guiding me. Fussing with my collar, Mama. The dance is starting soon. Is my hair smooth enough? He's sure to be there. You're kind of losing it, honey. No. Grandma, your hair is perfect. I mean, she kind of didn't really have it to begin with, but, you know. Fucking weepers. Just go. Just go. Failure to comply will result in immediate arrest. Excuse me, everyone. Excuse me, Mr. Rats. I hear you. Help me out. Oh, come on. They fucking blockaded it. I mean, they already had blockaded it, but I forgot. Hip. And don't shoot me in the back, you cunts. Like, you have to think, that's a whole tin of jelly eels. I really like eel, but probably not jellied. Yeah. I mean, there's only so many ways you can eat eel, right? Ah, uh, you can have a quite a bit of ways, actually. Yeah, but there's only so many good ones. It's not like a potato or, like, everything, pretty much every Everything you, you can do to a potato, it is delicious. Yeah, and it's an improvement on just eating a raw fucking potato. Do you think you could eat a potato raw, like, just biting into it like an apple? Um, I don't know if that would be healthy for you, but, I mean, gun to my head, I guess I could. Yeah. All right. Wow, that was a really successful mission. Yeah. I didn't die a lot. I don't think I died at all. High five. Imagine, <laughs> imagine uh, we we're, we're we're doing the mission wrap up. Huh? Oh fuck, piranhas. Imagine we're doing the mission wrap up and Corvo's taking his mask off and Sam is like, you've done a good thing for the city today, Mr. Rathano. You really, and Corvo's like, yeah, yeah, hold on a second. <laughs> and he just you're free, boys, you're free. He, he unleashes all the rats, yeah. <laughs> Sammy. Ready to go back, Corvo? You made short work of things. Damn straight. Maybe we should get her into some actual people clothes instead of bright white. Let's get her back. All right. I only killed 40 people. Yeah, still high chaos. <laughs> uh, I killed a civilian. That was the madam. She's technically a civilian. Oh, well. And I did the special actions. Those two. Right. Hell yeah. Do you want to do the wrap up? Yeah. Okay. The wrap up of the mission. Going back to the combat spot. Oh, sure. Okay. Emily is now in the protective care of the Loyalist. With her well-being temporarily assured, it's time to remove the Lord Regent's remaining allies. The next one is very interesting. It's kind of like Clue. And isn't that just an intriguing sentence to hear? So you did the business, did you, Corvo? I'm not one to speak against my betters, mind you, but if anybody ever deserved their fate, it was those Pendletons. What business are you talking about? Oh, I, uh... Grown up business, girl. I mean, your ladyship. Forgive me. <laughs> it's okay. 
I heard a lot of growing up business at the Golden Cat. <laughs> yeah, this was kind of like that. I should concentrate on piloting this. Corvo fucked them in the ass. Oh my god. The Ricker. The Ricker could mean anything. It's like yams. It's a multi. It's a multi-purpose slang term for anything. Daddy, do you kill people? No. Young Blood's dripping off of me. <laughs> a rat squeaks from my pocket. Pleased to meet you. As am I. <laughs> no, but my like children do. Tower? Squeak, 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 squeak. Yes, you may. You'll get to see it all. The entirety of the Hound Pits. All three rooms. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista, Corvo. I'll see you later. Bye bye, sweetie. All right. You do not fail. Talk to me, Avalok. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, is our a good own handshake. Will assume yeah. Their votes in Parliament. So yeah, because one he's night, got the money of that family. Most men do in a mm -hmm. lifetime. Our and Pendleton now has three votes. But for now, Lord Pendleton. Because he's the only survivor of the Pendletons. Nice. So now we have another two votes in uh, Parliament. All right. Ooh, we doing it. Ooh. Lady Emily has been recovered, and Lord Regents uh, from the Lord Regent Control, Pendleton Brothers, are neutralized. Still only got four. Sweet. Are we finished? Um, I was going to go talk to Lord Pendleton because he'll want to hear about how I didn't kill his brothers and grab this, the upgrades. Sure. Piero, talk to me. Ask me for any gear you need. You got it. Fake Otacon. <laughs> Oh, I could buy a rune. I love that little thinking sound you do. The yeah. <laughs> um, do you think I should get one of these? Um, reloading either of these is pretty solid, because reloading them is really what can fuck me over in a fight. Getting more shit for the crossbow as well. I love this crossbow. Yeah, do that. Okay, what should I get? Uh. So also of note, the, the cross. I don't, I don't the, think the range matters. The crossbow has four upgrades. This has one, but it's all three of the former upgrades besides the sleep darts. But it's loud and lethal, as opposed to silent yeah. and non-lethal, or silent and lethal. Um. I can also carry more bolts or bullets. I would say more bolts. Okay. Capacity, yes. So I've now doubled it. I can carry twenty total. Nice. Um, and I can buy a rune as well. Yes, yes, let's get that, and then okay. let's let's put it uh, to do the, 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 the... And then I'll grab these. You know, what is it? What is possession. It possession, thank you. Uh, oh, every, every time. Possession! Yes, yes, yes! Woo! Strategic tips. Possession is very powerful, allowing you to merge physically with an animal, such as the fish or rat, for duration. You must have an unobstructed path to your target. It is useful for stealth, allowing you to hide in small paces, or move through spaces normally too small for water, like water-filled ventilation pipes, drainage pipes, or ventilation duct, rather. Enemies will try to stop you from possessing a rat. While possessing a hound, you can sprint fast. At level two, you can possess humans at will. Your control of humans is limited, so combat or fast movement are not possible. Possessing a human allows you to perform simple actions, such as collecting objects or opening doors. Allies of the human you're possessing will not attack you, and security devices attuned to the human you're possessing, like the arc pilot or wall of light, won't harm you. Nice. If you're falling, possessing a human or animal on the way down will break your fall. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah, that's really cool. Wonderful. Yeah. Give me an ore and herbs. Oh, man. That's a good mission. That might be one of my favorites. Yeah, I really enjoyed that. And, and one of the thing is, is like, one of the reasons that that mission is so amazing is because of how well it builds on everything you do in the previous one. And I almost wish that that was, and, and like the thing is, the reason that it's so great is because that's the previous mission sets it up, you know? So how far are we through the game now? We're probably 40%, maybe halfway. Okay. Very short game, but very yeah, replayable. Yeah, yeah, I noticed it. Cause like uh, we're coming to, um, we're coming to a high point in the story and that usually only happens like, you know, at least 30% through a game, yeah, so... Yeah, like, there's only, like, five missions in this game. It's very short. Corvo, the Loyalist Conspiracy thanks you for your work. I don't know if I can. My own brothers. We never believed that you killed the Empress. 
It made much more sense that the royal spy master, now the Lord Regent, was behind it, aided by some of his key allies. We spent a lot of money and exposed ourselves to great risk in getting you out of prison. But we did it because we believe that you're the one that can make the difference. Oh, and Havelock's looking for you. I didn't, I, I didn't kill your guys. Where's Wallace? Wallace! You're promoted wherever you are. Head lackey. I suppose this means I'll have to have children. Or else recognize one of my bastards. Fucker. Jesus. I really like the amount of movement that you can get. I can't imagine playing through this game without buying it. Without buying all the extra magic shit. Yeah. And that's an achievement as well. Uh, it's, it's called Mostly Flesh, I think. Mostly Flesh and Steel, maybe? Mm -hmm. uh, and it's just to get through the game with only whatever magic powers you get given automatically. I think I would like to do that for like a personal playthrough. I don't know. Possession and Rat is really fun. Uh, yeah, right. I think you honestly might want to try uh, Ghost. Mm. Never ever getting caught. Oh, I'm not a stealthy individual. Yeah. Um. You also might just enjoy doing the. What will we do with a drunken whaler? What will we do with a drunken whaler? What will we do with a drunken whaler early in the morning? Your turn. Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner. Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner. Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner. Early in the morning. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Early in the morning. You go. <laughs> Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver. Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver. Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver. Early in the morning. Stuff him in a sack and throw him over. Stuff him in a sack and throw him over. Stuff him in a sack and throw him over. Early in the morning. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises early in the morning. So these are Harpooner songs. Nice. That song was one of the trailer uh, themes. Ooh, there's a book over there. Jaffer's tail. Nina kissed me farewell. So intrigued by those fucking sexy plays. Yeah, I know. I'm just waiting for the next part. I'm like, ugh. Bated breath, you know? One of the things, like, it is absolutely ridiculous that a play can be erotic. Okay, but I absolutely, um, if we can't find any other ones by the time the game is over, I want to look it up and read it. For yeah. the LP, if we can find any more. Oh, yeah, that'll be the outro for the last episode. Um, yeah, I think it's ridiculous that... Because you can have sexuality and romance in a play. I think it's impossible for you to have an erotic play. You can't hold that fucking... Does my bed not have a fucking mattress? <laughs> Holy shit. Is this where I sleep? This is... It says Corvo's room when you run in. Poor guy. I, I want to try to run in again and see if I can trigger the... Load fucking... the bed in. I thought he had a bed. This is my fucking... The fuck? Why don't I have a mattress? Can you, like, go to sleep, maybe? No, there's no prompt. Oh, poor guy. What Goodness. the hell? Maybe it... he sleeps over there. Maybe I sleep in a chair or something. This is... Yeah, maybe I put my head in the cobweb and take a <laughs> nap. The spiders braid your hair for you. Um, we were supposed to end the episode, and oh, goodness. we started fucking around. <laughs> I mean, you have to go to bed. Can we go get some ice cream first? Sure. All right. Um, I've been Alfred. I'm Sarah. We, uh, had a very, very successful mission. We rescued Emily. We, um, put the Pendletons, uh, into their own mind as, into their own minds as slaves. We sang a little ditty. We, we did sing a song. I'll probably clip that. Um. Clip it out? Yeah. No, no, no. I'll leave it in the episode, but then oh. I'll clip it out and upload it as its own video. Yay. In case people want it. Oh, okay. I want it. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
Remind me to do that. And it might be in a couple of months when the episode actually comes out. <laughs> That's we, okay. We're recording these with lead times. It's currently August still. But anyway, I've been Alfred. That's been Sarah. Yes. Bye. 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 Remember to whale people. <laughs> that, rat, that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of troll we can get ourselves into.